So I recently partnered up with SawStop to design and build this shop cabin that you see hanging behind me. And it's got a ton of storage space and features that you can pick and choose from to fit your needs. Along the bottom here is where I store my most commonly used tools, like drills and impact drivers. On the side, I even got a place to store some pneumatic tools. You know, if you're into that kind of thing. If not, just swap that out with some of these hangers and store more battery power tools. And on the inside of the cabinet, there's a lot of shelf space to hold accessories and supplies. And I even got a place over here to hang a couple tools that I don't use as often, but still want to have easy access to for when I do need them. On the bottom here is where the battery chargers go. And the reason why I mounted them on an incline like this is because I personally feel that this makes the motion of removing and putting the batteries back in feel a lot more natural. And also, I guess it looks kind of cool. All right, if you're interested in building this shop cabinet, we actually put together a full set of free instructional content on SawStop's website. It includes a full build video, a written article, a SketchUp model, and a full set of plans, including the cutting diagram and step-by-step -step instructions. And to get all of that free content, just head on over to SawStop's website through the link in the descriptions. But in the meantime, I want to give you guys a quick glimpse of the build process, which I really hope you enjoy. Once again, this is Alex from Bevelish Creations. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.